Carissa. Yeah. Hi, Mommy. Hi. I want to help you not be so sad. What's that? You sound sad. Mm. I guess there's not much to be happy about, huh? Yeah. <laughs> there we go. So, I'm gonna go home. Yeah. Yeah. I can't. You need any water? No, I'm gonna go home to, to my mama. To your mama? I understand. I love my mama. Mamas are the best, aren't they? Huh? Mamas are the best, I said. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well. It's okay. Well, I know you're upset. I love you so much, though. Okay, this I'm Carissa, mm -hmm. and you're my favorite person in the world. You mm -hmm. hear me? And you always will be my favorite person. Mm -hmm. And I know you want to go home to your mommy, and I totally understand. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And I'm here for you. I wish, I wish I could be here every single day for you. And I'm working on that. All right. Mm -hmm. But you've been an amazing, strong woman <laughs> to get through all of this. She and you, yeah, yes. Yeah. And you still do it, smiling and dancing on most days, which is so cool. You mm -hmm. love to dance and make people laugh still. That's huge, Mama. God loves you. Huh? God. Who's that? You know, God. Oh. God. Jesus. You still know about Jesus? Huh? You still know about Jesus? Yeah. Yeah. I'm just, uh, gonna go home so okay I think I think I like that little way you gonna go that way yeah okay if you want to lay down and take a nap I can help you lay down no I'm, I've, I've got to do everything you do yeah. no you don't I'd love to help you I love you uh -huh. I love you <laughs> you want to go lay down yes yeah. I'll show you I guess. I realized the most important thing is that my mother has a roof over her head, food and drink, and, you know, has somebody there to pick her up if she falls. Um, and the facility that she's been in has really, you know, they do, they take care of her um, to an extent, but they don't take the kind of care of her that obviously I would. And I suppose I hold back from saying much because I feel guilty that I, it's just not feasible really and never has been for mother to move in with me. Is there a way that I could make it happen? Oh, I'm sure there is, you know, you can make anything happen. So I feel a little guilty saying anything because, you know, ultimately if I want someone to take really great care of my mother, I should be doing it myself. And I did try to visit mom every day sometimes more than once a day if possible even with her living about 40 45 minutes away from me now versus the seven hours she used to live away um however the little things like her clothing you know i looked in her closet it was a mess and 
the clothing that was in it, most of it wasn't even hers. I didn't even recognize it. There wasn't much in there. The laundry baskets were overflowing. Some clothes I recognized, some I didn't. One of the pillows was disgusting and did not have a pillowcase on it. The room was dirty. The bathroom was dirty. I am really, really distraught today thinking this is September. I've barely seen my mom and I have barely been in her facility since March. What has this year truly been like for my mother?